Well, it's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Tomorrow is going to be, next couple days is going to be shaky. I'm on my way to get to Mumbles, man. You can see it's 11:15. Uh, We're getting a little earlier start today. Tide's going to be messed up. But we might hunt up in the top of the damp sand in the dry, dry zone and see if we can find some bottle caps for testing. Maybe as the tide gets off, we'll be able to get down further. I don't know. It depends on where we go to. But you'll know that in a few minutes. Stand by for more. Some of y'all know where we are. Some of y'all won't. We've been here before. The passageway to the yellow metal and the bottle caps. Well, the tide is really high. I think we're never finding that point. Really well, we've been 10 minutes, no targets. This is the first one, 11. Uh, 11. These are bullet casings. A lot of bullet casings in this place. I got six scoops off of it. I give up. I let Danny okay. dig on it for a while. I think it's iron. Grunt it, sound iron, then it would be good. Then it would be grunt, then it would be good. So we were going to dig it just to see what it was. Yeah, we, we're going to leave that alone. Yeah. I saw it fall out. It's tiny.
bullet jacket. I guess you gotta pick it up to find it. Hey, hey, hey. More jacket. 40 minutes was enough. Waves too big. Had to run for my life. Eight times. Still got wet feet. Rocket scientist sometimes doesn't pay off. We be back. Maybe later today when the tide gets off. Maybe not. Stand by. Well, we moved north to 10th Street. Let's see what that looks like. I don't know. Maybe they moved it for the winter. Well, here we are. We'll get back to you. Danny's gold chain right there. I'll show it to you in real life in a minute. It's a really thin one. The chain part, the coin is at the upper end. Ten. There's a chain. You can get the chain at one. If you swing really slow. But once you get down to the end, The gold coin and the bezel come in good. You can see it's thin. Now he says his, his CTX won't find this. Can't even hear it at all. I mean, you got to be right on top of it to hear it. But it comes in as a one. Let's see what. Put it under an inch or two here. You want to cover it up a little bit. Now we're in a dry sand, keep that in mind. You can hear the coin okay. I got my sensitivity at 18. Let me crank it up to about 23. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Now you can read it good at 23. Brazil reads it one. I checked it up 23. It's better at 23. Oh, at 22, I'll go at 23. I don't know. I don't know if I'm hitting it or what's going on this thing. Scrape it right on top of it. Where, where, which one? I don't know where the hell it's at. Oh, okay. Yeah. I definitely hear that. I mean, yeah, 
You can hear it okay. It's it the won. one, you know, but the CTX won't pick that up then. No. I can't even get it to and I, I can rub the chain on the coil and ball it up in a ball and it won't pick it up. But at least it's it is picking that up. I'm gonna put it in gold mode, see what happens. Uh <laughs> Tent stake. Minus four, twenty-two. Minus four, twenty-two. All right. I don't know what this is. Reading thirteen. Didn't discriminate. We'll go to all metals. Minus two. Right on top is a 13. Iron grunt here.
Minus right now. Let's see what this is. Minus and a good number. I think it might be a cap. Nope, not a cap. Jumpy. Starts out at a six. Minus eight, six, and eight. I don't get any grunt. Some jumpy noises. I don't think that's a cap. Aluminum. Junk aluminum. We got a minus and a 15. You see it? Minus 3, minus 5. A little grunt. Hear it? Good 12 and 13 right on top. A bottle cap. See it jumping? Let's find out. Fairly deep, whatever it is. I guess you could class that as a bottle cap. Maybe not.
There's a rusty one laying right on the ground. First one we found on top. I don't like the theory though. The theory's failing. I get a little minus number right there. At least it's jumping around a lot with a minus and a plus and a minus and a plus. That's a good sign, I think. What do I know? I don't think it's a bottle cap, I just think it's a piece of iron junk. Doesn't give us anything positive. Thirty-nine. I'm not even gonna waste my time. Cap. Here, let's see what this is. Multi jumping around sounds, pluses, minuses. Grunts, good sounds. Deep in China. I think we got us one. Yes, sir. Reed, look at that bottle cap, deep bottle cap, with pretty good ID. Jumpy, jumpy, I like it, I like it, I like it. I won't say it's another cap. We got the business now. Yes, sir. -ry. The business. Another one. Let's see. jumping around so let's find out what it is
It could be a good target. It's got some. Thing. The damn wind is picking up. It's getting cold. It's a good. It's a good sound on top, but it jumps around from 12 to 28. I'm thinking it's a cap. Uh oh. Uh oh. We're getting better, we're getting better. There is hope. I'm thinking cap again. A deep one. I don't hear it. I don't see it. We got fooled that time. One of them little wrapper for bread. Got a little piece of wire in it. We left that other spot. We headed to a third spot. We're on the bay now. We were at the Landonado, of course, 10th Street. We'll see how this hot goose is. I had to put some more clothes on. Almost managed digging already. Can't leave in five minutes, he goes crazy. What are you looking for, Chinaman? Yeah, I can hear it over here. Hand lid, oh, okay. Nice, nice sounding five. Great matter. Best of it. One dime. Some crap. It was a good testing day. Won't see you tomorrow in the land of Nada. I'm going to be knife zillering tomorrow. I got knives to pick up, hatchets, axes. I got to pick up some knives tonight. It's going to be a blade kind of day for me tomorrow. I think it might rain anyway, so I guess it's a good thing from that standpoint. All right, I'll get back to you when I hear from the mumbles, man.